Good morning, dear students. Today we will discuss a very important topic of grammar that is direct and indirect speech. So, as we have certain rules to change sentences from active voice to passive voice, right? We have rules for every tense. Similarly, we have rules for every tense when we change sentences from direct to indirect speech. So, let us start from simple present tense. I have written one sentence of simple present tense that is Daisy said I like ice cream. See subject and verb. Verb is in first form. Right? It is telling you that the sentence is in simple present tense. Why identification is important? Because here I have written it separately. But as an exercise you will get it all mixed up. So the first step is to identify the tense of the sentence. So, I am revising it again with you. Verb is used in the first form here. So, this is simple present tense. Let us change it. Daisy said, I like ice cream. Daisy said, said always changes to said that. Remember, okay? Daisy said that. I will change into she. Daisy said that she liked ice cream. And your verb will uh, become, uh, your verb will be used in the past tense. Because this had already happened, no? Daisy already told you. And now you are reporting it to someone else. Now you are telling it to someone else. So this is already the past tense now. Daisy said that she liked ice cream. Okay, come to present continuous. Daisy said, I am eating. Am eating is telling you. That the sentence is present continuous. Why? Is am a plus first form of verb plus ing. So, am eating is telling you about present continuous. How you are changing it? Said will change into said that as I told you earlier. So, Daisy said that she was eating ice cream or something else. Daisy said that she was eating. Okay, come to perfect. Perfect is has have plus third form of verb. So, have eaten. Daisy said, I have eaten. Have plus third form of verb is telling you that it is present perfect. Said will change into said that as I told you. Said that. Daisy said, I have eaten. Daisy said that she have will change into had. Daisy said that she had eaten. Okay. So, now let us discuss the rules about present perfect continuous Simple past and past continuous. Present perfect continuous. Daisy said, I have been eating. So, how you come to know that the sentence is of present perfect continuous? Have been. Then first form of verb plus ing. Have been and first form of verb plus ing tells you that the sentence is of present perfect continuous tense. Let us change it. Daisy said, I have Daisy said that. Said changes to said that. So Daisy said. Said will become said that. Daisy said that. Have will change into. Have been will change into had been. Daisy said that. She had been eating. Becomes your indirect. Come to simple past. Simple past is simply second form of verb. Sent. Daisy said, I sent the email. Now, sent word is telling you, sent here is a verb which is used in the second form. Second forms are used for simple past tenses. So, Daisy said, I sent the email. Is simple past? Because sent is present. Okay. Second step. Said will change into said that. Daisy said that she had sent the email. Right? You will add had with the verb. Past continuous. Past continuous is was verb plus verb first form plus ing. So was teaching tells you this is past continuous. Daisy said I was teaching. Daisy said that. Said will change into said that. Right? Daisy said I was teaching. Daisy said that she had been teaching past continuous when you change was you use had been teaching means had been 
so these are the rules which you have to remember now let us learn how to change direct into indirect for past perfect first of all we have to learn how we will confirm that a sentence is in past perfect tense daisy said i had eaten had eaten had plus third form of verb is telling you that this is past perfect has have plus third form of verb is present perfect had plus third form of verb is past perfect so had eaten tells you that this is past perfect let us change it daisy said i had eaten okay so said will change in to said that as i told you earlier daisy said that daisy said i had eaten daisy said that she had eaten right come to past perfect continuous how you will come to know it is past perfect continuous had been plus first form of verb plus ing if it was has been eating has been eating have been eating it would have been present perfect past means had been eating had been plus first form of verb eat plus ing so this is past perfect continuous it is confirmed let us change it daisy said i had been eating said will change into said that daisy said that she had been eating come to future daisy said we will do the work we hum kar lenge daisy said we will do the work will do will shall plus first form of verb is telling you this is simple future right future tense so daisy said we will do the work daisy said daisy said that said will change into said that daisy said that we will change into they like i changes to she i changes to she we changes to they daisy said that they would do the work so see i we will change into they daisy said we will do the work daisy said that they would do the work so these are the uh, these are you can say the rules you have to memorize that a certain tense will change this way into indirect tense into indirect speech